These photographs are from the large collection of images taken by Brisbane freelance news photographer, Mr. Fred Port. He had an office in the Telegraph Chambers building on Queen Street in the 1920s, and this first photograph shows trams backed up along Queen Street, as well as scores of people crowding the streets and even climbing out on roofs during what we believe to be the visit of the Duke and Duchess of York in 1927. The Duke and Duchess of York are Queen Elizabeth's parents, and at this time they were visiting for the opening of Canberra. This second shot was also taken during the Duke and Duchess's visit and shows the use of electricity as a relatively new and exciting medium for commemorative display. Entire buildings were lit up and covered in flags, much in the way that we light up the Gateway Bridge for special events today. This is one of a series of nighttime shots that Port took of these after dark spectacles. Here, Port has travelled out on a bright, sunny day to the airfield to capture the first student of Brisbane's flying school after his successful solo flight over Eagle Farm Aerodrome in March 1927. Flight and flying in general were newsworthy items at this time, and Port would have sent off the developed prints to local newspapers for his fee. Because of the development of cameras and film with shorter exposure time, photographers were able to capture important moments as they happened. Here, Port has captured a conversation between the Governor and the Federal Member for Brisbane, as they sat in the RNA showgrounds. Port's entire collection tells us what people and media outlets saw as important in the 1920s. Cameras, together with the photographs that took them, provide a really valuable historical resource for us today.